In Photoshop, you can combine patterns, very easily combine patterns when they're layers, because then you can actually experiment with the patterns because you can change them at any point. Also, you can relayer the reposition of the layer. So I'm just going to quickly go to Layer, New Fill, Pattern, click OK. And now these patterns are from graphicextras.com. Now you could use any other patterns you can find on the web or native ones. So I'm just going to select pattern there, click OK. Now I'm obviously I could just use that pattern, but I, I want to maybe create a slightly more complicated pattern than that. So I'm just going to go to now I could duplicate that one. That's another quick way of doing it, or I could create a new fill layer again. So duplicate layer, click OK. So I've got two layers the same. Now I can blend obviously those two. I could actually change those ones. So difference, you end up with obviously no difference whatsoever. But if you go to back into the pattern, you can change the scale. So you just change the scale, create really abstract designs just by subtly shifting. Also, you, of course, you can move the pattern layer. So not only that. Also, I just increase the size quite a bit. So just do that. And then I can shift that so you can get really weird. Look, not only that, you can then change the mode from difference to darken, color burn, overlay and so on, or exclusion. Of course, you can change the pattern again. You can go to the style lock and click that, select another design. So you've got another pattern there. You can go and shift the underlying pattern. Click OK. Go back to that one. Change it to difference again. Maybe change that pattern. Don't want that pattern. Change the scaling. So and so on. And of course, you can also, if you wish, create another one. Just say duplicate layer, click OK. Change that pattern and you can create, well, at the end of the day, you can actually end up with pretty extreme color changes. Of course, once you've done all that, you can then you say, oh, I like that pattern, or maybe not because it isn't the greatest of patterns, but obviously trial and error working. You can actually say that. And of course, then you just go and quickly apply an effect or use that as a source for a pattern maybe, if you wish.